How would you like to fill your pantry with canned beans for about 25 cents a pint jar? Our pantry is out of canned beans, so today I will be canning these black beans in pint jars to replenish our stock. You can use any kind of dried bean, not just black beans. You could do Great Northern, Pinto, black, kidney, red, and so forth. Come along, see how this is done. You're gonna need some clean pint mason jars. They do not have to be sterilized or anything special, just clean. I'm getting several jars out as I am preparing to use eight pounds of dried beans today. To each jar, I'm adding half a cup of the dried beans I won't be canning these without salt today, but you may add salt if you desire. Canning beans is one of the easiest things you can put up for your pantry. It's simply dried beans and water and some thyme. To each jar, I'm gonna add water to the base of the neck, leaving one inch of headspace. This is using a no-soak method. This is the easiest method of canning beans for me. And in my opinion, there's really no need to soak and pre-cook your beans because your pressure canner does it all for you. Just add your lids and your bands to fingertip tight. Nothing too drastic. We are loading the pressure canner here. I'm using our double decker canner today, so I will be able to process 18 pints at once. Once I get all these jars in here, I will be adding three to four inches of water. Just making sure the water does not come up over your jars, but yet you have enough to process. There's the rack for the second layer. We'll secure the lid. These will be processing at 10 pounds pressure for 75 minutes. If you live in a higher elevation, please check your trusted canning guide for proper processing times. Once I get the lid secure, I just turn the burner on high Here's the weight, 10 pounds. Now we will just wait for the pressure to come up to 10 pounds before we start our timer for 75 minutes.
We're up to pressure. I've now started my timer. Time's up and the pressure canner was allowed to naturally fall back down to zero. I'm just removing the jars here onto some placemats to cool. I will let them set until morning where I will then remove the bands and wash each jar and get ready for storage down in our pantry. But you can tell here by using the no soak method, they plump up just beautifully. Ready to use in various recipes. It's the next morning. I've removed all of the bands. I've washed every jar. All of them sealed. Out of the eight pounds of beans, I canned 31 pints. Not too bad, for 25 cents a jar. This is a good start to replenishing our stock in the pantry. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next video. Take care, everyone.